Hello Aries, welcome on my channel Triple Two Tarot. This is your girl TM and today I'm doing Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, November 2019 general love reading. And this is the general reading. Please keep in mind if it resonates with you then all the better. But if it's not then you can come to me for personal reading if you want to. Prizes and details are already given on my channel. Contact me on my email address. So let's see what is happening in Aries love life in the month of November 2019. What is coming towards my Aries people? You can switch the energies if you are a cross watcher. Let's see what is happening in Aries love life. What is coming? What is coming? What is the main theme for you in the month of November 2019? Okay. So I'm using my these oracles for you guys. Uh, this is the main theme for you. So the first oracle you have the opportunity. You can see that. Uh, I'm also seeing the moon here. Okay. So we recently definitely have. It's look like this is a new moon. Like it's not a full moon obviously. But this is a new moon. So new moon always represent new energies. New beginnings. And obviously new opportunity. And this is the also card of opportunity. I'm also seeing that there could be a possibility. That right now you could be going through some issues. Some problems that you are some chaotic situations or circumstances in your love life in your career that you don't know where you are going where your path is where your it's like you are uh, you're looking for something you're searching for something your 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 soul searching uh, your soul is searching for something or you could be searching for new love new job new career or something that is your searching i'm hearing but this is something that is your and this situation is very chaotic and you don't know uh, what you have to do, what, where you need to focus, what you have to do to achieve that goal, to achieve that thing. So this is opportunity coming for you in the month of November. There could be a new opportunity coming in your way to meet someone new, to fall in love, to could be uh, start your own business, could be starting a new job, something. But definitely this is opportunities coming in your way. This is like blessing from the universe that is the main theme for you and the next you have the freedom okay you can see that these cards are really definitely telling you that something big is coming in your way and this freedom card is definitely representing here that uh, you are flying high and high and I also feel like there is something coming in your way that will make you free that will set you free from something if right now you could be going through some dark periods dark situations there is some I feel like light is coming in your way because we I'm seeing the moon and I'm also seeing the sun like night and day I'm seeing here because every dark night has a definitely a new day a new beginning so yeah uh, I feel very strongly like if they, if something is disturbing you right now, if something is not going well for you, but in the month of November, there is big opportunity coming in your way. You have to grab it. Okay. I also feel like for some of you, you could be traveling um, in the next month. Okay. Like the, uh, could be for study, could be for job. I also feel like good group studies is happening. Group uh, opportunities are coming in your way to work with uh, people like people. Uh, could be you're starting your own projects, you're working with people, something like that. Now let's see what is coming towards you. Who is coming towards you, Aries? In love, okay, what is happening for you in the month of November 2019? Let's see. What is the energies for Aries people out there? Okay. That's good. What is the outcome, please, in the month of What is this? Why? Hmm. So what I'm getting here that what is on the table here is you have the two of wands could be dealing with another uh, fire sign Aries Leo or Sagittarius long distance relationship. Um, they could be on the distance from you if it's not the physical but I'm seeing the physical and geographical distance between you and this person but if it's not then definitely this is emotional or 
distance like you guys are not talking but this is two of wands like decision has to made here uh, and i feel like some whoever is coming into your way they're looking at you i feel like they're looking at you like they really want to talk with you they really want to confess something they want to communicate with you but at the same time they're looking at you like they're waiting for you could be to make a move with these two of wands okay then you have page of pentacles could be younger earth sign you are dealing with taurus virgo or capricorn but i see this person is definitely planning to contact you to communicate with you they could be um, apologize to you because page is also with these pentacles like they could be apologize what they did to you if they did something wrong to you something like that but i see this is like communication like this person definitely wants to talk with you they want to express it they want to tell you uh, what's going on and how they feel okay this could be you you could communicate with this person vice versa if you're cross watcher i don't know but this is the energies aligning someone is making the decision and they want to communicate they want to talk pages also page of pentacles also talk about asking you out if it could be possible likes asking you out like let's meet together let's have some conversation together i want to talk with you i have to discuss something thing okay the next you have the two of cups reverse could be water sign pisces cancer scorpio are you dealing with i feel that you both are not on the same page right now um or you could be uh, with someone who is already with someone else okay and uh, this could be a chance okay there could be uh, that you are in love with someone or you are talking with someone or you are interested in someone that they are already with someone else that's why you guys are not together not on the same page i see this is not a mutual partnership i feel this is two of cups reverse you guys are definitely not together not communicating well and also not together what i'm getting here then you have nine of cups pisces cancer scorpio again the water energy i feel that your wish is coming true uh, soon if this person did not i feel this could be a past energy that you guys are not together uh not talking together not in a relationship okay but i feel that now with the nine of cups it's like your wish is coming true whoever this person rejected you or ignored you in the pre in the past okay they were not ready for this relationship or they were not ready with you to be with um okay now with the nine of cups it's like your wish is coming true this person is coming back because i'm seeing this person is me this is a very strong energy someone is uh, deciding to communicate someone is also like thinking about it like planning about it they already made up their mind but it's a matter of just communication that when they will then they will make initiative and will talk to you and your wish will come true with the nine of cups because it's look like you're waiting for this person to come towards you okay and they are coming vice versa if you're a cross watcher okay you have three of pentacles okay and then you have the full rewards you could be dealing with aquarius and we have earth again so what i'm getting here that three of pentacles you could be more focused on your work on your business or uh, right now okay you're working very hard um you're trying to detach from this connection you're trying to detach because this person is not with you or not together with you uh, they are not communicating well uh, but i feel that uh, this person is coming back towards you with the 3 of pentacles they are ready to partnership with you they are ready to work with you now but in the past they were not ready so this is the good energy for you but still i feel like the full rewards here uh, if you are waiting for reconciliation with someone i feel that still the november is not the month that you guys are coming into union or reconciling i feel here this still because there is a lack of trust between you and this person this person is not trusting uh, they are this person is not taking the risk by the way so this person could be detaching and they are trying to more focus on their work they are not ready for uh, love right now they are more focus on career job or study whatever they are doing they are more focused on that things rather than the love so if you are waiting for reconciliation because a fool is a second chance i don't see this person is coming back because they are more focused on themselves with the 3 of pentacles but at how at somehow i feel that the communication is coming there is some conversation is happening between you and this person there is some type of communication is coming that will set you free this is freedom okay that will make you free and then what is the outcome between you and this person you have nine of swords so you look at this gemini libra aquarius so yeah there is a lot of struggle going on okay uh, whoever is coming towards you they definitely want to talk with you they are, they are up at night it could be you 
okay so uh, definitely someone is not sleeping at night they definitely want to talk they definitely want to communicate they want to express what they feel what they want and it's really tiring that exhausting that they can't communicate with the nine of swords okay i also feel like with the nine of pentacles um, energy here uh, for some of you like you will get over from this energy you will more focused on you you need to heal and you you could be healing from this situation you will heal from this situation again i'm seeing here that whatever the dark night whatever the dark period you are going through right now you will get over from this energy and you will heal okay with the nine of uh, pentacles here you need to more focus on yourself go with the flow if something is not working in your favor in your love in your career i feel that still you need to put your work and you need to put yourself first what i'm getting here with the nine of pentacles and nine of cups so yeah, this could be your energy, you're more focused on you, you're trying to make yourself happy, you're trying to heal, you're trying to more uh, achieve your goals, you're, you're making yourself happy and, uh, and going with the flow, you're not, you're, you could be detaching from um, love and something like that. For others of you, it could be possible that the person you are dealing with, they're more focused on you, okay? Like they need some time to think about that they are ready for love or not but i see some type of communications are coming i also feel like this is all about work here like someone is definitely with the page of pentacles three of pentacles and nine of pentacles someone is definitely focused only on on their career job study all about themselves they're trying to achieve their career uh, they are trying to achieve their um whatever the, this could be you this could be that person they're all about themselves all about themselves because right now they're not ready for love they can't that they can't take risk in love okay they're not trusting this love situation or something like that but obviously decision has to made someone really need to make made up their mind that what they want what they have to do because they are indecisive okay so the advice for you here is the four of swords for the month of november so yeah you need to take rest, retreat from this situation, more focus on yourself, try to heal yourself and go with the flow. If something is meant to be in your life, they will come towards you, okay? So go with the flow. That's your uh, the advice for you in the month of November. Otherwise, I'm seeing that someone really need to make up their mind and I'm seeing communication is coming that will set you free. Or you will hear some truth or some um, communication from this person that will set you free. Because if, if, it, if they will not, then definitely you will up at night here. So someone is definitely here disturbing. They definitely want to um, really want to communicate, but it's not happening because they're desiring to be with you. I feel that whoever this person here is, they're up at night, they're crazily, crazily, madly thinking about you. They definitely want to talk with you. This is how they're desiring to be with you. But at the same time, they can't because they could be waiting for you. So someone really need to make up their mind because the other person is just, you know, like going crazy because there's no communication, there's nothing happening, there's no movement, okay? But I see that definitely something will happen that will set you free or you will change your, you need to change your focus and you need to more focus on yourself until this person come and make up their mind, okay? Because someone really need to make up their decision, make up their mind that what they want, they're indecisive, okay? So this is what happening for Aries in the month of October, sorry, November 2019. I really hope it resonated for you guys. Like, share and subscribe to my channel. God bless you.